Uh, the case has uh, been reopened a number of times over the last uh, 40 years and it's always reevaluated for what else we can do to try to generate some new interest in the uh, most recent uh, examination of this case we felt that uh, most importantly it was to get out there that uh, there was a tooth discovered at the scene and hopefully people will think back to that time and remember somebody uh, remember a man who was missing a tooth around the time of the murder and give us a name and uh, and help us resolve this case I mean I can't speak for previous investigators, but certainly there's always been value in having hold back information. Um, when you have a six-year-old girl who's murdered, there's a tremendous amount of interest and in numerous, numerous tips, hundreds of tips come in. In order to filter through those, we often use uh, hold back evidence in order to uh, weigh the tip and compare it to what we have and decide whether or not this is a uh, tip that requires further examination or whether it's, it's kind of uh, off, uh, off, off the charts, so to speak. Uh, in this case, we felt that the value as holdback evidence uh, wasn't as much as it, uh, the uh, value was for uh, getting it out to the public. Right. Call us at 255-6700. Uh, 4830 is the extension. That's the major crime office. You can always call Crime Stoppers as well. Um, we're just hoping that people uh, remember something and reach out to us.